Cheryl Allen has reminders around her Albuquerque home. This prep pen was from the President of the United States at the time. Of the 28 days she spent as a paramedic at Ground Zero. My heart felt like somebody had squeezed it. Just like really tight. She had just wrapped up an overnight shift at an Albuquerque hospital on September 11, 2001, when the world changed. I was working in the emergency room department downtown off of Dr. Martin Luther King Avenue and the news came on. At the time she was also a paramedic for a disaster medical assistance team that gets called to help when needed around the country. She got a call less than six hours after the terrorist attacks. Asking me when and if the airspace was cleared to fly if I would be available to head to New York and I didn't even Hesitate. She says she arrived to ground zero by the 26th. And I couldn't believe what I was seeing at the time. Along with 33 other New Mexico doctors, nurses, suture techs, and others to help many people recover for nearly a month. Whether it was cardiac monitoring, whether it was starting IVs, whether it was suturing. And on this 20th anniversary of that dark time, she says she remembers the heroism that came out of the ashes. Never be afraid to reach out and help someone that needs help or that you think might need help.